set for a big one tonight. Game four of the Eastern Conference semifinals. And 2K Sports is thrilled to bring you in on all the action. Hi, everyone. Alongside Grant Hill and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson. We'll hear from Allie LaForce in just a moment. Hey, Allie. Well, Brian, the Heat are united. Coach Spolster said, quote, it's not about stats with these guys. And that's so unique. You can talk about it. You can teach it. You can rant as much as you want. But this league is based on celebrating a lot of other things, and rightfully so. But ultimately, it's about winning. There it is. Thanks, Allie. And now the opening lineup for New York. At forward, it's Barrett and Randall. Jalen Brunson is out there with Josh Hart. And it's Robinson in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And for Miami... Lowry and Hero are the backcourt. Caleb Martin out there with Bam Adebayo. And it's Butler in at the small forward position. You look at New York, and I don't think anyone thought this is how the series would go. They've run into a buzzsaw. But a win tonight would even things up. And this is where your best players really need to step up and take charge. Ride the hands that got you here and leave nothing on the table. Now here's Barrett. Robinson. Great positioning on the putback. He really gets in perfect position for the follow. Just a terrific read. Outside Butler. Brunson against Lowry. And it's Butler with the jam. Smart playmaking by Kyle. Moving the ball to a guy with a good look. Pass to Barrett. Five on the clock. Hart from long range. Rebounded by Butler. Now Hero. He's covered by Hart. Hero, the pass to Martin. Banked it in off the glass. And setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. Now here's Barrett. Finds Brunson. Offensive board. Randall, good. This is one of the things you love about Randall. Relentless on the offensive glass. Pass to Lowry. Here's Hero. Back to Lowry. And he makes it on the layup. Just owning the painted area. If it's working, no need to change. New York has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Barrett against Butler. Hart with it. Outside for Randall. Butler with a steal. To the paint. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. Did you see the game plan is working already? Four straight makes to start this one. And a chance for a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for the Heat. For me, they made a point to attack inside early in the game, and it's paid off for them. A lot of solid looks in the paint. Yeah, also, you got to appreciate how unselfish they've been. I mean, the ball movement has been impressive, and the assist numbers are off the chart. Free throws good out of bio. I just love Adebayo's passion for the game and his desire to reinvent his position. Knocks it loose. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Butler. And here now a list of the players who have had the hottest hand in the playoffs. Second is Jimmy Butler. Perfect time to take it to another level offensively. He's really carried them at that end. Robinson passes to Barrett. Outside Brunson. Takes a three. Counted from distance. You don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. The Heat have gone 4-4 four four from the floor. Perfect start. Pass to Adebayo. Over Robinson. Adebayo, no good. And that was a heat check right there. First miss of the night, but still shooting 80% as a team. Inside. Keeps it alive. 
Robinson in the post. He's against Martin. Misses in close. Here's Butler. No luck on that one. Some solid defense from Barrett. Adebayo against Randall. Over Adebayo. Another shot. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. It goes on Bam Adebayo. I mean, there's a lot of natural power to Randall's game. He's a handful in there. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw. When it comes to addressing his weaknesses, the right hand, the range, Randall has put in the work. Good on the second one. Just under three and a half minutes elapsed here in the first quarter. Lowry, the pass to Butler. Martin outside. Here's Hero. Oh, Robinson with a block. Right side, Barrett. Outside, Robinson. Pass to Brunson. For three. Get the rebound. Barrett. Outside Hart. Oh, the go-ahead bucket. No good. Well, you got to miss sometimes, but that one seemed like a gimme. Here's Hero. And that comes off the assist by Lowry. A focused individual. Hero's not going to let a little contact affect his shot. Outside Barrett. Outside Brunson. Hart. Six to shoot. Pass to Barrett. The three is up. On target from range. It's a tie ball game. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Now here's Butler. Here's Martin. Checked by Randall. Hero for three. Buries it from three. Hero's got five points. This is how Tyler Hero likes to roll. You got me, I'll get you back. Back to Brunson. It's hauled in by the Heat. Now Lowry. Up top, Hero. to Lowry outside for Butler fires the three the Knicks with the rebound Randall's got four rebounds in the game gets it to go that makes him two for three in this game a high percentage shooter inside that's exactly where you want to get Randall the ball back to Butler Pass to Hero. Martin against Randall. The Heat need to get one up in a hurry. Hero, no good. And they've come out with a fearless approach on the boards. To the inside. That's good from Robinson I'm on the out. assist by Randall. Robinson's gotten his second bucket of the game. Miami calls timeout.
Love is checked in for Miami. And the Knicks making a change here as well. Grimes, he's checked in for Barrett. Miami trailing. Hero outside. Pass to Adebayo. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. It's going to go on Mitchell Robinson. A powerful athlete who's still developing his skills. Adebayo has become a threat at the offensive end. And he can't get the first one. Victor Oladipo is checked in for Hero. Quickly is checked in for New York. And no luck that time either. I can't believe he missed those shots. Wow, he is usually lights out from there. Randall. Yes. And a nice assist from Brunson. Randall's gotten his third basket of the night. <laughs> this run has been fueled by their Matador defense. Pass to Oladipo. Now here's Butler. Defense is right there. Again, the heat misses. No question who's in control of the board so far. Here's Randall. Misses off the right iron. Easy chance for mid-range. Wouldn't be surprised to see them run that play again. The shot by Oladipo. No good. Here's New York. They're on a 13-5 run. Quickly finds Brunson. Pass to Grimes. Now quickly. Over Love. And it's quickly with a miss. Miami's gone one for three from beyond the arc. Lowry outside. And here's Oladipo from the arc. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Randall's got his eighth rebound here tonight. And it's time to take another look at that powerful block. Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. Robinson, he's checked in for Miami. Vincent comes in for Lowry. And a switch here also for New York. Rose is checked in for Brunson. For Miami, they've got 6 of 14 in so far. For three, Oladipo. It's hauled in by Robinson. Robinson's got six rebounds in the game. Oladipo against quickly. Pass to Grimes. Randall outside. Six on the shot clock. And he's going for the lob. And a big finish by Robinson. What a beautiful look. Randall continues to round out his game in the prime of his career. Right side, Love. Now here's Oladipo. Knocks down the triple. To stretch out the defense, you just need enough guys on the floor who can make that shot. Pass to Grimes. Quickly with the ball. Over Oladipo. Robinson in the post. Covered by Love. Let's go with a three. Oladipo with the rebound. Miami's gone just two for six from the arc here in the first. Robinson with the block. He's kind of lost his way this period. Having a hard time getting anything to go down. Had he played to stop that easy layup right there. I mean, make him earn it at the line.
throw drops for quickly. The Heat making a switch here. Struess is checked in. Hardenstein, he's checked in for New York. Toppin comes in for Julius Randle. Quickly drops them both. Heat shooting 41% from the field so far. Pass to Vincent. On the wing, Struess. And it's Butler with the jam. What a physical play from Butler going for a dunk and jamming it right in on top of the defense. Here's Hardenstein. Rose outside. Here's Grimes. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Nice pass by Derrick Rose, spotting a wide open guy from the corner of his eye. There's a minute 54 left in the first quarter here. Pass to Struess. Beyond the arc. Second shot opportunity. And it's Love missing. The Knicks with the lead. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Despite the amount of punishment Rose has taken to his body, he still plays with no fear. No good. Explosiveness by Derrick Rose is one of the reasons why a lot of guys do not want to guard him. And the second free throw is good. Miami trailing. Pass to Vincent. A minute 29 left in the first quarter. Shot clock at six. Driving in. Outside for Love. Pulls it from the corner. That one falls. Well, we know Love's been a great shooter for many years, but his catch and shoot game has reached another level. Rose with it. Pass to Hartenstein. Over Love. And Hartenstein gets it to go. And the Knicks lead by five. And for the Heat, they're shooting about 43% since tip-off. Now Struess. Outside Robinson. Love with the ball. Can't hit that time. New York goes the other way with it. Here's Rose. Again, the Knicks. Good for two more. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Here's Butler. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. Embracing the physical nature of the game, Butler loves getting contact while shooting. And he drops the first. What's impressive about Jimmy is how much of a one-man army he can be. He makes the effort to be everywhere on the floor and does all he can to help his team. And that's good as he hits both shots. Money from the strike. He does a great job night in and night out. Rose outside.
Kicks it to quickly. Launches a three. Doesn't go for him. And we've reached the end of the first quarter. It's the Knicks up five. And quarter number two will get underway just after this short break. And we welcome you back to game four, folks. Thanks for joining us. All right, before we move on, what do you guys think about what we've seen from the Knicks? Well, it's pretty obvious. I mean, cashing in on extra opportunities. That's how they built this early lead. You can do everything else right, but if you fail to take care of the defensive glass, you're killing your chances. And the Heat shooting around 41%. Lowry and Hero are the backcourt. Max Struess is out there with Caleb Martin. And it's Adebayo in at the five down low. That's the group in the game for the Heat. Martin finds Adebayo. Struess against Barrett. That one goes. Count it. Struess has gotten his first basket of the night. It's fun for us to sit back and watch him go to work. But that's our job, not the defense's. They left him too open on that play. Now here's Barrett. And Kyle Lowry is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul. Outside hard. To the middle. Here's Hardenstein. Count it. All three of his attempts have gone in. This is what the analytics prefer. Shots at the rim or from three. Brunson against Lowry. Pass to Adebayo. Puts it up from 12. And too long on the shot. You wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the glass. Hero against Hart. Now Toppin. The kick out to Brunson. Stolen by Lowry. Down low. On the wing, Struess, guarded by Barrett. Struess against Barrett. Lowry, good. Lowry's got the second bucket on the night. Muscling through contact, one of Lowry's specialties. Very strong upper body. Hero against Hart, up top, Toppin. Pass to Hartenstein. Second chance effort, and that's two points on the layup. Hardenstein's got eight points. That's just staying in the moment, keeping with the current possession. Hero outside. Back to Lowry. Out of bio with it. Out to Lowry. 4-3. Second chance shot. Out of bio. No good. The Knicks have got two of three shots to go in the second. Here's Brunson. The rebound by Lowry. And for the Heat, they're shooting 41% in this game. Hero with it. And it's Brunson picking him up. And stolen by Brunson. To the inside. Here's Barrett. Basket is good. Off the assist from Brunson. Five points in the game. Beautiful location on the pass, as usual. Led his man perfectly. Pass to Struess. Back to Hero. Again, the Heat misses. And they've committed to controlling the boards, and it's paying dividends. Oh, he nails that one. Three for four now. Good heads up basketball. Season opening and capitalizes. Outside, Struess. Lowry outside. Lays it up and banks it in. Lowry's got four points now in the quarter. What a move by Lowry. He can create shots with his handles. Outside, Hart. Back to Brunson. Out to the right wing. But against Martin. Five on the clock. Hart can't hit. 
For Miami, they've gone three for seven here in the second quarter. Here's Hero, and he banks in the layup. Now just a five-point Nick lead. At 6 five with the advanced skill set, Tyler Hero can easily be good defense. Back to Brunson. Pass to Barrett. Toppin outside. Jacks up a three. And Hero grabs the board. For Miami, they've gotten four of eight shots to drop in the second. Adebayo up top. And denied! He sends it right off the glass. And he recovers it, and he's able to get it back. The confidence continuing to grow off the board. Adebayo takes it right back up. Outside Hart. Now here's Brunson. Here's Hardenstein. The putback. It's good on the putback. And the Knicks lead by five. Playing at his tempo, his pace, he's been dialed in all night. Pass to Struess. Back to Hero. The three. He can't get it to go. New York goes the other way with it. Their biggest lead of the game was nine. And the foul called on R.J. Barrett. That's his first foul. You're not going to be perfect. For the most part, they've really taken care of the ball. Victor Oladipo is checked in for Miami. Randall, he's checked in for New York. Lowry outside. And he lobs it up to the rim. And here's Randall. Seven points in the game. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Randall's got nine points. Terrific play. This is why you run your offense through him and live with the results. Now Lowry. Six points for him. Here's Martin. That's good. And so Lowry with the assist. Lowry's got his third assist of the night. I mean, they've been relentless. Just keep getting shots at the rim. Now here's Hart. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game from him. Pass to Hartenstein. Now Barrett. Here's the three. Drills it from deep. The defense takes a chance, leaves him open at the arc, and he capitalizes. Miami's gone 0 for 2 from outside in the second quarter. Oladipo outside. Outside Struess. From six feet away. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. All right, guys, what do you think so far about the offensive approach for the Knicks? They're unselfish. They're passing the ball well, setting up teammates, playing team basketball, and their focus. You know, they've also been very effective at running the floor. Just a ton of points in the fast break. It's been a big part of their success. The first one falls. A different look for Miami. Kevin Love's checked in for Bam Adebayo. Butler comes in for Martin. And Vincent is subbed in for Lowry. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. For New York, they've gotten 7 of 12 shots to go here in the second. Pass to Hartenstein. That one falls. Nice time feed out, that time out. from Rose. Rose has got his fourth assist in this one. Timeout called. The Heat. And as the coaches draw up their strategies, the players staying hydrated with some Gatorade. That's key to keeping them at their best all the way up to the buzzer. It really is. And every one of those players knows it. They're all making sure to stay hydrated. It's impossible to play your A game if you're not getting enough to drink, especially towards the end of games when the physical toll of a long contest really starts to add up.
Robinson, he's checked in for Struess. The Heat have gotten six shots to fall out of 13 attempts here on the second. Pass to Robinson. Right side, Love. Back to Robinson. Four on the clock. There's the triple. Randall pulls down the board. Randall's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. There's one principal reason why they're sitting on this lead. Rebounding. Miami trailing. Robinson passes to Oladipo. And here's Butler. And yep, it's good. Butler's got eight. Wow, the strength of Jimmy Butler fends off defenders well when he goes up to score. Quickly against Oladipo. Here's Grimes. Pass to Rose. No good there. Off the double clutch. Miami has gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Love with the ball. The versatile skill set of Love. The defender has no idea which move he's going to. throw drops for love where a guy plays the power forward and sometimes the center spot he has great touch at the line Kevin Love is a tremendous face-up shooter and the Knicks making a change here Robinson's checked in and Love drops them both <laughs> they've been impeccable from the line here in the second period doing what they can to try to build some momentum. Quickly, outside. Here's Grimes. No good on the three. The Heat have gotten 7 of 15 shots here in the second quarter. Robinson. Here's Butler. And that one goes. 4 for 7 for him so far. Look, when you play against Jimmy Butler, you know you're in for a battle. Excellent job extending the possession. loose and again the Knicks missing and the Heat shooting just around 47% in the second quarter Oladipo the pass to Love the game now all tied up Love's got four points now in the quarter drawing so much attention Oladipo rotates the ball timeout, to the open timeout. man timeout called the Knicks it's time to talk this over and try to put a stop to this run because right now it feels like the pace is being dictated to them they need to go back to playing their brand of basketball.
Rose, the pass to Randall. Quickly up top. Rose outside. Back to Quickly. Down to five on the shot clock. Inside. And a big finish by Robinson. The great read between those two guys. The defense didn't stand a chance, B.A. These two teammates right here, Grant, they are connected. Now here's Robinson. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Oladipo. Randall pulls down the board. you got to love how they've been crashing the boards, fighting hard for every miss. There's a minute 40 left in the first half. Miami's gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Robinson against Butler. Fires for 3. Vincent can't hit. New York has gone 1 for 3 from downtown here in the second. Passed it quickly. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Man, good whistle there. Shooting two. And he knocks down the first one. Good on the second, so he makes them both. 116 left to play in the first half. Pass to Vincent. To the paint. Randall with a steal. To the middle. And here we go, the Nixon transition. Derrick Rose in open space is a treat to watch. Love the way he took off and scored that one. Here's Vincent. Oladipo outside. That's good from Robinson on the assist by Oladipo. That's how you set the table and everybody gets to eat. Rose outside. Has to grind. Back to Rose. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Rose has got four points in the quarter. This is why Derrick Rose is considered one of the best at his position. He is not afraid of going down low. Eight second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Oladipo, the pass to Robinson. Misses the three. Oh, love the intensity in which they're hitting the boards. Randall against Love. Randall outside. Here's Grimes. And so it's the New York Knicks with a six-point lead at the close of the quarter. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. All right, now let's check in with Ali LaForce. Ali, what do you have? Thanks so much. I'm here with Coach Tom Thibodeau. And Tom, what's it going to take down the stretch to win this ballgame? I think just tough defense, take good shots, not turn the ball over, play smart. Back to the basics. Thanks, Coach. Thanks very much, Allie. And, folks, we'll be right back to start the second half of this game. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back, everybody. This is Ernie Johnson along with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. We hope you're enjoying this round two conference semifinal. For the Knicks, trailing two games to one in the series, they've come out with purpose tonight. They know that losing this game would put them in an almost impossible situation. And let's get your thoughts, Kenny, on the Knicks. The bench unit was an essential part of the puzzle in the first half. They really stepped it up in a big way, and that helped out. And now the starters can appreciate not having to carry the load on their own. Jack, let's get your insight on Miami. Fellas, just a total lack of effort on the boys. I'm not getting technical because I never really do. This is all about heart, wanting the ball, hunting the rebounds, 
If they were better in that area, they'd probably be winning this game. I'm just saying. And now with the second half about to get underway, let's send you back courtside. See you, everybody, with Kevin Harlan. Happy to have you back with us for the Eastern Conference semifinals on 2K Sports. Miami trailing. So on the floor for New York. At the four and the five, it's Randall and Robinson. Josh Hart is out there with Jalen Brunson. And it's Barrett in at the three. And out of bio slams it in. Jimmy Butler is becoming a nightmare of a matchup. Off the pick and roll. Now he's using the pass to free up other guys. Robinson on the wing. Outside there. Fires from deep. And it's Miami with a rebound. Outside Butler. Over Barrett. Butler can't get it to go. And the Knicks shooting 46%, a decent average so far. Inside. Butler against Barrett. Outside Hart. Five to shoot. Barrett passes to Hart. And here's Brunson from the arc. They get it back. And a big finish by Robinson. And that's a double-double for him now. And that's why you don't give up on the glass. Man, his efforts, well rewarded right there. Working hard, beating everyone to the ball. He does this night in and night out. Now here's Butler. He's got 10. Pass to Martin. It's hauled in by Robinson. Just over a minute and a half played in the third. Now Brunson. to Randall and a foul called on the way up so he'll take two from the free throw line it's on Tyler Hero the rugged nature of Randall's game just daring defenders to foul him Good on that one. And he sinks the second. Here's Butler. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Martin against Randall. Robinson with the block. Shaky start to the half. Going one for four. Still trying to find that groove. Great opportunity. Just couldn't complete the play. Yes, getting a little ahead of himself on that play. Out of bio, that's good. Some shooters get tunnel vision, but Tyler keeping his eyes up and his options open delivers a great pass. Now here's Barrett. He's got 10. Outside Robinson. To the inside. They double Randall. And it's Jimmy Butler with the foul. That's his first foul. And now it's time to take another view of that huge swat. Yeah, this is the elevated energy level you expect in the postseason. Chasing down blocks and making an impact. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Here's Brunson. Got it. Good job in the low post. Brunson's got five now. 
poor interior defense. If you play him soft, timeout, he's going to kill you. Miami calls timeout. <laughs> and we'd all love to hear what goes on in those huddles, but we just get the snapshots. No, we're left to infer from the adjustments we see on the floor. Three minutes gone now in the third quarter. Lowry, the pass to Butler. Brunson against Lowry. Pass to Hero. Outside Butler. Clock at six. Throws it up high. Oh, what a nice defensive play to disrupt the lob. Hero against Hart. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. The officials were right on top of that one. And he makes a first. It's both from the stripe. Third quarter of basketball here. A little under three and a half minutes gone by. Butler against Barrett. Outside Butler. Over Barrett. Butler finds Lowry. And again, the heat missing. Defense dodged a bullet that time. Total breakdown. Barrett. Good. Barrett's got 12 points in the game. Like a matador. Ole. There was no defense. That has to be one of the easier shots I've seen tonight. And this is what happens when you start to break your opponent's spirit. The resistance is no longer there. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. And there's the slam. Dunk to finish it off. Defensively, you can't afford to let them get to the rim that easily. Well, that might be why their deficit is what it is right now. It's a backbreaker for your defense, giving up easy buckets like that. Now here's Butler. He's got 10. Pass to Lowry. A shot to stop the run. Not going to go that time. Good work defensively by Randall. Outside Hart. Now Barrett. Outside Robinson. Now here's Randall. Over Butler. Randall can't hit. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Oh, Robinson with a block. Hart passes to Barrett. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Caleb Martin. That's his first foul. And just wasn't able to set up in time. And the Heat making a change here. Struess has checked in. Hardenstein, he's checked in for New York. Toppin comes in for Randall. Brunson passes to Hart. Barrett with it. Count that one. He's scoring at a nice clip. He's 6 of 9 tonight. Putting consistent pressure on this defense. Just the threat time of out, him out, out there makes this offense work. Time called here. Miami decides to talk it over. Yeah, hoping to tap into something that'll get them clicking. Yeah, these guys need to work together as a team, as a unit. Try and carve out some easy buckets.
Brunson against Lowry. And he lobs it up and finished off by Adebayo. Wonderful play with that long wingspan and huge hands. Adebayo catches and finishes with ease. Back to Brunson. It's hard on the wing. Pass to Hartenstein. And here is Barrett. Shot clock at five. And here's Brunson from the arc. And he can't get that one. And the Heat going the other way now. Just imagine if he was shooting better. The lead would be even bigger. What you love about Lowry is his physicality in the lane. It's amazing at his height what he can do. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Knicks. Smart ball handling from them in this one. Passing around to get ahead of the defense and putting it in the hands of ready shooters. And also the number of points they've scored in the paint has been impressive. Shooting two. His coaching staff encouraging them to keep going inside. That free throw good from Lowry. You know the universal theme to Lowry's game. It's toughness. Mentally and physically, he tries to wear you down. Both free throws good from Lowry. New York has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. Brunson finds Barrett. Brunson against Lowry. Pass to Hart. From down low. And he gets the jumper to drop. Hart's got six in the quarter. The defense was certainly a little late in reacting to the step back. Lowry, the pass to Struess. Hero for three. It's rebounded by New York. Here's New York. They're on a 15-6 run. Hard against Hero. Hard can't hit. And the Heat shooting a less than average 27% in the third quarter. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It goes on Josh Hart. What an intelligent player Kyle Lowry is. Clever at finding ways to get fouled while shooting. Shooting two. The first free throw is good. Love is checked in for Miami. Robinson comes in for Hero. Grimes, he's checked in for New York. Quickly comes in for Brunson. Both free throws good from Lowry. They're doing some good work at the line this half. For New York, they've gotten six of their first 12 shots to drop in this third. Pass to Hart. Here's Grimes. Just five to shoot. Pulled the shot a little left. The bounce goes his way, though. And the Knicks lead by 13. Robinson with it. Love with the ball. He's got six. Struess finds out a bio. Oh, an amazing finish with a hand right in his face. Adebayo's got eight here in this quarter. Pass to Grimes. And here's Hart. Here's Hartenstein. Counted by Adebayo. Down low. Here's Grimes. Kicks it to quickly. Fires the three. The rebound by Lowry. Lowry's got his fourth rebound in this one. Driving inside. Love inside. 
He's against Toppin. Offensive rebound. Adebayo, that's good. Timeout, timeout. Adebayo's got 10 points here in the second half. Bam is cooking right now. Once he flips this switch, he's tough to slow down. Now a timeout called by New York. Victor Oladipo is checked in for Miami. And the Knicks making a change here as well. Rose is checked in. The Knicks have gotten 7 of 15 shots to hit in the second half. Pass to quickly. To the paint. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. One falls for him. So he gets them both. Miami has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Lowry outside. Pass to Robinson. Get through, get through, get through. Back to Lowry. From deep three-point range. Quickly with a rebound. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10-rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. The Heat shooting 40% so far in this one. Here's Adebayo. Excellent D there from Toppin. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. I know he's on a cold streak, but he can't let that get in his head. And his rhythm, it's been way off. The goal now might be to get him something easy at the rim so he can just see the ball go in through the net, and that helps. Here's Rose. After the basket by Miami. Quickly outside. This one for three. It's hauled in by the Heat. Adebayo's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Can you believe it? He's missed every shot he's taken. Yet this team still continues to hold the lead. Here's Grimes. He's got six. Toppin. And he floats it in for the easy two. Credit the sweet setup on that one. Nice job. Those passes have to be right on the money around the painted area. And out of bio slams it in. I would imagine it's nearly impossible to not get fired up after that play. Grant, check these guys out on the bench. Their reaction says it all. They are fired up. And so it's New York with it. After the basket by Miami. Pass to Rose. Uses the glass on the layup. Rose has got seven. High percentage look. This is what your offense is designed to do. Lowry, the pass to Love. Come to me, come to me. And that one drops for him. 
When you look at Love's strength and conditioning now, compared to when he entered the league, this is why he's able to finish so timeout, often timeout. through contact. Now a timeout called by New York. Vincent's checked in for Lowry. Mitchell Robinson, he's checked in for New York. Randall comes in for Rose. One minute left in the third quarter here. Pass to Grimes. For three, Randall. Adebayo grabs the board. Adebayo's got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Oladipo, the pass to Robinson. Back to Oladipo. There's the three. The shot, no good. Their strong work ethic has been evident on the glass. Really getting after it and being physical. Seven second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Back to Hart. Here's Randall. The putback. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And the Knicks lead by 11. The effort, the position, the timing, all there. And add instincts to that. He can sense where the rebound's going to go. And so it's the New York Knicks closing out the quarter ahead by 11 points. The flow of the game has favored them in general. But hey, the tide can shift. Back to the game after this break. And now we have a moment to reveal our State Farm assist of the game. And from the two-guard spot, an unselfish play like this sets a fantastic tone. Whatever the offense requires, that has to be your mindset. Always thinking team first. And welcome back, folks, for more Eastern Conference semifinal action. On the wing, it'll be Hero and Butler. Kevin Love out there with Caleb Martin. And it's Vincent in at the point. That's the group in the game for the Heat. Here's Grimes. Outside Robinson. To the middle. Grimes' shot is off. So frustrating when you can't get anything to go down as you're trying to help your team finish the job. And down it goes. Two points. The Knicks with the lead. Outside Barrett. Randall draws the double. Left side Barrett. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. The 
Free throw drops for Barrett. They're doing great work at the free throw line this half. That bodes well for their chances to close out this game. And Barrett drops them both. And collectively, as the game has progressed, they've been shooting really well from the charity strike. Pass to Vincent. Barrett against Butler. Hero for three. Good, and Butler gets the assist. Butler's got three assists in the game. Coming into his own from distance, Hero is money. Back to Brunson. Fourth quarter still young, just over a minute play. And the call is going to be, yes, an illegal screen. That's just his first turn of the night. What a steady, efficient game he's played thus far. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. So difficult to stay planted, especially with all the motion around you. Annoying turnover. The Heat making a switch here. Lowry's checked in. Hero, the pass to Love. Lowry against Brunson. Over Brunson. That one a little long. You kind of wonder where his head's at. The shot selection hasn't been there. And of course, that one was just crazy. Pass to Grimes. And there's the lob. Hey, great communication on the lob. And the Knicks lead by 10. Oh, man, take a look at that one. Just a textbook alley-oop. Beautifully done. He served it up on a platter. Now here's Hero. Back to Lowry. Outside for Butler. Just four to shoot. Outside Love. Shoots over Robinson. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. And the Knicks shooting the rock well at 46%. Here's Barrett. And he lays it up and in. Barrett's got 10 points in just the second half. They just look so overwhelmed inside. You know, that's why they continue to get attacked. Lowry finds Hero. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. Jalen Brunson picks one up. He's an offensive-minded guard with limitless scoring potential. I think Tyler Hero will be a household name soon enough. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And that one falls for Hero. And so Hero nails both of them. For New York, they've gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. Pass to Grimes. Barrett up top. And the layup is good off the glass. Barrett's got 22 points. Beautiful call that time up the floor. The hard screen frees him up for the bunny. Here's Lowry. No good. Some solid defense from Brunson. He just can't find a consistent way to score. And this team could certainly use it. Since hitting two triples in the first half, he's been non-existent from out there. Hero, no good. For New York, they've gone three of five since this fourth quarter started. Off target from outside. Not himself from range right now. But the only way out of this funk is to keep trying. Lowry, no good. New York has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. That shot wide open. He's got 25. They have leaned on him all quarter, and it has worked to perfection. Lowry outside. Pass to Love. Back to Lowry. 
Hero for three. And that comes off the assist by Lowry. Lowry's got his seventh assist here tonight. His third triple of the game. A little more success from out there in the second half. Now here's Barrett. Now here's Brunson. Just five on the clock. Oh, there's the alley. And a big finish by Robinson. Mm, slams it down with two hands. Man, they're really getting aggressive now. Hero finds Martin. Butler against Barrett. Puts it up from 12. And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Robinson's got 15 rebounds here tonight. Outside Brunson. It's Barrett on the wing. And again, New York with the triple. He's putting them to the test this quarter, attacking every chance he gets. Left side, Butler. Pass to Martin. For three, Lowry. And the Heat, another three. Tough-minded individual. Lowry answers back with his own three on the other end. Now a timeout called by New York. It may be a player's league, but the coaches obviously play a big part as well. Yeah, if that weren't the case, you wouldn't see so many coaching changes in the offseason. And the Heat making a change here. Adebayo's checked in. And let's send it over to Allie LaForce. Hey, guys. Over the last break, I listened to Tom Thibodeau address the team. He said, we've got the upper hand, so let's not waste it. Keep getting stops. Keep finding buckets. So the message is, it's not over yet. Back to you. All right. Appreciate it, Allie. Miami's gone three for three from downtown in this fourth quarter. The shot by Butler. No good. For New York, they've gotten six of ten attempts to drop in the fourth quarter. Outside Barrett. Pass to Randall. And it's Randall with the jam. If you let Julius Randall get to the rim, this is what you can expect. Butler passes to Hero. Back to Butler. Some solid defense from Barrett. New York has got two of five threes to go here in the fourth. Inside, here's Grimes. No good that time. Excellent D there from Hero. Well, Miami shooting 33%. This hasn't been their quarter. Butler on the wing, guarded by Barrett. Miami, no good that time either. You know what, though? They keep calling his number despite the difficult quarter he's had. Pass to Brunson. Here's Randall. He's guarded by Hero. Randall draws the double. Looking to get it going. Brunson misses. And despite a struggle scoring the ball, they've done enough to build this lead. Lowry, good. That's a grown man's basket right there by Kyle Lowry. He is so good at getting dirty down inside. Outside Brunson. Back to Barrett. 
Randall outside. Fires top of the key. That shot off. And Miami will go the other way with it. Down low. Here's Martin. And down it goes. Dunked it through off a beautiful setup. Nice look there from Kyle Lowry, the Villanova Wildcat. Pass to Robinson. Brunson with it. He's guarded by Lowry. Brunson against Lowry. Barrett passes to Robinson. And here's Brunson from the arc. The offensive rebound. Randall, good. One thing we knew Randall could do entering the league, finish inside through contact. Hero outside. Pass to Adebayo. Brunson against Lowry. And here's Butler outside. That's good. And so Lowry with the assist. For New York, they've gotten 8 of 16 attempted shots to go here in the fourth. Here's Grimes. To the inside, Barrett. It's rebounded by Jimmy Butler. Butler's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Hero for three. It's rebounded by New York. Here's Randall. Nice touch on the shot from close range. Miami has gone four of six from deep thus far in the fourth. And the Heat call time here. Protecting the rim has to be their top objective right now. And it boils down to the question. Toughness. One team showing it, the other allowing itself to be bullied. All right, time now to present our new balance player of the game, Jalen Brunson. Can you say vintage? <laughs> wow, this was a vintage performance. I mean, so much of the game is about the three ball today, but his focus was going hard into the paint and doing damage from inside. Yeah, and they were on thin ice in this series. He knew it, and he went out there and did something about it. He wasn't about to let them go into a 3-1 hole. Now here's Martin. Here's Butler. Good on the 13-footer. This is one of Jimmy Butler's go-tos. He loves the jump shot from mid-range. Now here's Randall. Shoots off the step back. And Hero grabs the board. And the Heat shooting around 41%. Here's Butler. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. Two shots, five, elbow, two. Oh, take a break, take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Butler hits them both. 
And here's Randall. 157 left to play in the fourth. And he lobs it up top. Oh, a flawless finish on the lob. Saw his teammate with a path to the rim, and boom, lobbed it up there beautifully. Very smooth catch and finish. Pass to Lowry. There's a minute 34 left to play in the fourth quarter. Down to five on the shot clock. He shoots. Again, the heat misses. Grant wouldn't be a bad idea here to slow it down. Yeah, the coach is definitely looking for patience and execution. Outside Hart. Now Barrett. Outside Brunson. Pass to Robinson. Hart from long range. And they turn it over. Shot clock violation as the buzzer sounds. seconds left to play in the fourth here's Hero the Knicks pull it in here's Hart soft touch off the glass and the Knicks lead by 13 excellent effort on the road they've literally sucked the energy out of this arena and when you're on the road you can't be tentative coming into a game like this I thought their aggressive approach was the difference. You know he's pulling his weight, but they still find themselves behind. Back to Brunson. Pass to Randall. It's hard on the wing. Six on the shot clock. Off with the layup. Butler against Barrett. The shot by Butler, no good. Hard to convert against that kind of defensive pressure. The rim protection at its finest. The result is the same whether you block the shot or simply change it. And so it's the Knicks taking care of business in this one. A huge victory for them, nodding this series to two. We've got ourselves a series, folks. Neither team with much of an advantage. It's a tight one. Time for us to say so long. We hope you've enjoyed our coverage during the second round of the NBA Eastern Conference playoffs. So for Grant Hill, Ali LaForce, and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson thanking everyone for watching tonight's game. We'll see you next time.